Are you running a business but you still don't have a website? Well, it's time to create one. Creating a website from scratch might seem like a daunting task, but Canva makes it easier than ever. So in this video, I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process of creating your own website using Canva. While there are many platforms out there for website creation, Canva simplifies the process without the need for any coding or technical skills. So if you're looking to create a simple website which provides information to your visitors, then Canva is a great option where you can easily build the site you want. And for those who are looking to build a fully functional website like an e-commerce website or a blog website with a lot of features and design options, then WordPress is the way to go. And by watching this video, you will be able to create a simple website just like this by using Canva. Then we'll see how to create sections like this. You can also customize your section and change the content like the text or the images on each section to match your requirements. Cool, right? So I'm Brian from Website Learners and let's get started. Now to create the website with Canva, we are going to do three steps. The first step is to create an account on Canva. To do that, just click the link below this video and it will take you to this page. Now click sign up for free, then log in with your Google account and it will take you to the Canva dashboard. Okay, once you have created the account on Canva, now you can choose the design for your website. To do that, here search for website and you will get different website designs to choose from. If you are looking for a specific category like an educational website or a business website, you can click on this drop down and choose the category. I am going to choose this design, so let's check it out. And here you can see a preview of the design. Now to use it, just click customize and it will take you to this page. Okay. Once you have chosen a design for your website, we can go to the next step which is to edit the contents of our website. Let's say you want to change this text. All you have to do is just select it and then enter the text you want and it will be changed. You can also adjust the size of the text by clicking here. If you click here, you will get different fonts to choose from. Now you can select the one you like and it will be changed here. In the same way, you can change any text you want. I am going to type about us and done. Next, let's see how you can change this image. All you have to do is just click on the image, then go to apps and click on photos. You can see that we have got different images to choose from. Or you can also search for the image you want right here. If you already have an image that you want to add, you can directly upload it from your computer and then add it here. All you need to do is just go to uploads, then drag and drop your image here and you can see that the image has been changed. Similarly, you can change the other images. Okay, next let's see how we can create a contact section like this. We have an image, a title and a contact address. To create a section, just scroll down and click add page. Then here we can add the content we want. Let's add an image, just go to uploads, then drag and drop the image here and it will be added. Next, let's add a title, just go to text. Let's drag and drop this heading text and type contact us. Alright, now to add the contact address, let's use the subheading text style and drop it here. Then remove this text and add your contact information. Okay, so now we have created the contact section. In the same way, you can create any section you want. Next, let's see how we can change this logo. To do that, just click on the logo, then click the delete icon and the logo will be deleted. Then drag and drop the logo from your computer and it will be added here. You can resize it like this and it's done. Now let's click preview and see how our website looks like. It looks pretty good, right? Alright. Currently, this website design is set as without navigation, which means the menu items will not be visible and to make them visible, 
Just click here. Click with navigation. And the menu will be visible here. All right. Now, if we click on contact, you can see it is taking us to the contact section. Then if we click on our journey, we are taken to the about us section. Now, since we have changed the title of the section from our journey to about us, we also need to change it in the menu. So to change it, let's close this. Then go to our about us section and click on it. Now, if we scroll down in the bottom left corner, you will find the notes. Just click on it. Then here on top, you can see we have this text. Just remove it and enter about us. Once you have done that, if you click on preview, you can see that it has been changed to about us. Now, if we click on it, you can see that it takes us to the about us section. So this is how you can rename the menu items. Now, if you want, you can see a preview of the website here. Now using Canva, you can also animate different elements on your website. So next, let's see how we can animate the section. To do that, just click on the section and click animate. Here you will find different animations to choose from. If we choose the rise animation, you can see that the logo, text and the image are rising up. If we use this pop animation, you can see that it pops out. So let's check them out here and choose the one you want. I'm going to choose this one. And in the same way, you can animate any element on your website. Okay, so now we have successfully created the website. Now before you move on to the final step, let me quickly tell you about an AI tool called Gravity Right. As a website owner, you might need to create content for your site like blog posts, product descriptions, or even scripts for videos like this one. But Gravity Right, you can easily generate any type of content. Just answer a few questions and there you go. You'll have a perfectly crafted content that suits your needs. No more struggling with writing from scratch. So if you want to save time and effort creating content, just try Gravity Right. Okay. Once we have created a website, let's go to the final step, which is to publish the website. To do that, just click publish website. Click get a new domain. And here you will get two options to choose from. We can either publish our website using a free domain or using an existing domain. If you have an existing domain, you can click on this option. I will show you how to publish it using the free domain. And you can create up to five live websites on your free domain. So let's click continue. And here you can enter the domain you want. I'm going to enter Swift Crafter and click continue. Then here you need to enter the details about your website. Now to change the text, just click on the edit icon. Remove this text, then enter the text you want. I'm going to enter Swift Crafter. Now to change the fav icon, just click on it. Then click on the plus icon. Choose the image from your computer. And it will be added here. Now click done. Now let's see how we can change this URL. This is the website's URL which will appear on the browser tab when we access it. Right now, you can see that this URL is quite lengthy because by default, it has included the template name with the URL. Instead of this, we can have a short URL like this, which is more clear. So to do that, just remove this text from here. Then just enter a simple name you want. I'm going to enter home. Okay, after that, just enter a small description of your website. Now this description will appear below the title and the URL in the Google search results like this. Once you're done, click publish. And there you go. Our website is now live on the internet. Now to view it, just click view website. You can see we have a website that we just created. And if we click on about us, it takes us to that section. Now our website is working perfectly and anyone on the internet with this domain name can access the site. Once you have published your website, if you want to make any changes to it, you can do that too. If you're looking for a more powerful and flexible platform to host your site, then I highly recommend WebSpace Kit, a super fast hosting platform 
that makes launching and building your WordPress website a breeze. With WebSpace Kit, you get a free domain, free SSL, and a drag and drop website builder with thousands of free themes and plugins. Plus, if you sign up using the link in the description below, you'll get a 10% discount on your hosting plans. So if you're looking for a hassle-free way to create and manage your WordPress site, check out WebSpace Kit. Okay, so that's it guys. This is how you can create a simple website for free using Canva. If you're looking for advanced features and professionally designed website templates, you can build your site with WordPress. WordPress is a very popular tool for creating websites and it's so easy that you'll be able to create any kind of website just by using drag and drop. It has thousands of themes, easy to customize, and you can also add any additional features you want by installing plugins. So if you want to learn how to make a professional website with WordPress, then you can watch this video. Or if you want to create an e-commerce website, you can watch this video. Don't forget to check out Gravity Write, our AI-powered writing assistant, and WebSpace Kit, a web hosting platform that makes it simple to launch and build stunning WordPress sites. Be sure to check them out using the links in the description below and get a 10% discount on your WebSpace Kit plan. And guys, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button for more cool videos like this one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.